I tip that money. I tip that money. Conor McGregor has 500k. It's it's like pocket change for this guy. So is he a man of his word? As he says, I'm a man of my word, right? So um <laughs> because I think this is all hype promotion. It's 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 business, guys. Let it's like that song, let's get down to business. <laughs> You know, it's like they just want to get get down to business, make it happen, make make a lot of money, make drama so they can promote the fight. I mean, honestly, if you think about it, remember what Habib and um, Connor had, you know, with the dolly throwing it at the bus. That was real. That was so believable. Stop. Hey, stop. 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 Hey. Stop. 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 So this, on the other hand. I don't know if it's believable. Um, maybe Connor just doesn't want to pay him out of spite, but it only makes Connor look bad, right? It only makes Connor look bad. And to be fair, I am a huge fan of Connor. I am a huge fan of Dustin. So don't even say that I'm not a huge fan of these guys because you know that I'm a huge fan of these guys. And it was so hard for me to pick who would win in their second fight. Now, with the trilogy fight, I am leaning towards Dustin. Is the fight even going to happen? You know, is the fight even going to happen? That's the thing, too. So sometimes, right, real life seems fake. It seems, like, crazy. But, like, I don't know. The more I read about this, the more I get into it, I'm like, maybe this is just all real, and it just so happens that they're getting what they want anyway, which is to promote the fight, you know? Because they do have their hot sauce, they do have their proper 12. I mean, it makes sense to create some sort of drama here, right? But maybe, maybe it's just all real. So, I don't know. I think I'm leaning towards that Connor didn't want to pay out of spite. And that it just so happened that it, you know, it's blossoming to promote the fight this way. And that that's how it happened. Maybe he did stall it. Maybe he was like, mm, I'm not ready to, you know, pull the trigger and send them that half a million dollars yet you know because half a million dollars is half a million dollars so you know he was he was a plumber at one point you know eating blueberries on ariel hawani show with you know not a lot of money like you know he was living off the government you know so he's not the type that obviously he spends his money you know and he buys lavish things but at the same time i don't know it just why would Dustin, Dustin's not the type of guy to have some shady foundation. He's not the type of guy to do that. And another thing, I really think that Connor, he, he doesn't want to give the money now because he lost, you know, and he's just thinking like, uh, I'm going to make it difficult, you know, like show me dot for dot. Where is it going? Where is it going? Um, <laughs> you know, so I uh, like, and then the other thing too, is like, if he loses to Dustin in the trilogy fight, um, and then he doesn't give the money. How is he gonna look in the end of all of this? How's he gonna look, right? Is he gonna feel like Like bad about everything of how it went or is he gonna end up paying? Is he gonna end up, you know, paying the money? Like he's, you know, it's it's very interesting how all of this is gonna play out if Connor would have threw the hot sauce at Dustin or something or made some sort of drama like I don't know about this like about the money because it kind of gets messy in a way and it's sad because it's it's sad because Connor definitely has the money and it only makes himself look bad and I feel like Maybe he wasn't wise enough to see that, you know, like if you think about like the things that he's done, right? He's made some not so great decisions, hitting an old man in a bar, things like this, you know, like throwing the dolly at the bus. So maybe he thought, oh, you know, I'm just not going to give him the money, you know, and I'm just going to like, how is that going to make you look? That's going to make you look like you're not a man of his word. And Habib is just laughing in the corner. <laughs> so, you know, like this just doesn't look good for Connor. Um, Dustin, on the other hand, I mean, it, it seems believable in a sense that where his defense is, he's just like, no, like my team reached out and you didn't get back to us. It just like the second I saw it and I was reading the tweets. Okay, let's read the tweets. Okay, I just want to read this one, <laughs> Connor McGregor. And you know, the second you go on their Twitter, proper 12, 
and the hot sauce and there's nothing wrong with that there really isn't you know and i bought the hot sauce i, I thought it was good i i've yet to try the proper 12 i mean i'm not much of a drinker but let me know if you if you had it if it's good right so conor mcgregor he says you ripped you inbred hillbilly why do you wink with your ears you effing brain dead hillbilly 500k with no plan in place ye hang tight fool you must be new to money the fight is off by the way i'm going to fight someone else on july 10th good luck on your old contract kid wow um you know like maybe it started off as if it was just gonna be you know something like i i don't really know where this money is going and i want to like know but at the same time i'm just thinking like how like why would you like dustin would never like it all goes to kids in need like he has such a big heart like you you see the work that he's doing like building wells in like uganda whatever the hell he does he does amazing stuff you know and it's just like i don't know like with everything mcgregor has going on i get it that you know 500k is a ton of money it is and you want to know where it's going i understand that Maybe there was a little bit of a miscommunication. That's the thing. Like, the deeper you go into this... Listen, the second I saw it, I'm like, fake news. They're hyping the fight. And then the more you go into it, you're like, is this real? Like, is this fight really not happening now? Is this fight really not happening? So this tweet's really funny. A donation, not a debt. <laughs> We've been a... Man, my, my uh, impersonation for Connor sucks. Um... We've been awaiting the plans for the money that never came. I do with all my donations. Know where it's going for dot for dot. Otherwise, it goes walking. Okay, it makes sense. As is in the case with a lot of these foundations, sadly. You took the MCG over the belt. Shows I was right. Okay, and then the diamond Dustin Poirier responds, 100%, never a debt you offered, we accepted. And like I said, your team never responded to our emails regarding the process of where the funds would be put to work. July 10th, you will taste defeat yet again. I feel like that's a really, um, you know, that's great. That's a great way to respond to that. But um i don't know guys let me know in the comments what you guys think is going on here do you think it's promotion obviously even if this is all real they're still getting what they want they're promoting the fight they're promoting the fight and i i'll i feel like it i don't think di like the diamond or notorious I don't think they would let this fight slip out of their hands because now it's even bigger than what it was. And I feel like Dustin is kind of like the champ in a lot of people's eyes, you know, now that Habib is not there. And Connor is Connor. Connor will always get, I mean, he'll always get big numbers. He'll always get eyeballs looking at him no matter who he fights. Connor won once, Dustin won once. Like I said, I'm leaning towards Dustin winning because of his activity. He's more active as a fighter. You know, Connor had that 40 second fight run with Cowboy and then he just fought Dustin. But other than that, he's kind of been a little stagnant in my opinion. So, you know, I, I see Dustin definitely winning. But, you know, Connor did amazing, amazing in the first round. We, we got to remember that, that Connor was doing beautifully and he could definitely win you know yeah let me know in the comments what you think about all of this it's kind of fun kind of fun drama two huge names you know going at it um and you know it's it's craziness but let me know in the comments what you think thanks